As regards China, um, so we mentioned, uh, we talked about China's comprehensive of national power and how it attempts to infiltrate a country in multiple ways. And the Indian strategic community has been at the forefront of understanding that and putting together what could be called a comprehensive national defense, where it has defended itself in multiple sectors. So, uh, you know, within a couple of weeks of Galwan, India was banning the Chinese apps, right? That, that I think surprised a lot of us who uh, aren't as uh, sophisticated, don't come from uh, the land of the Artha Shastra where you know, you've know you had this kind of <laughs> 2000 years of strategic culture. Um, and we're wondering why, why ban the apps? And then once that was explained um, that, you know, first of all, it's spyware, it's, it's sucking up the metadata, it's helping the Chinese develop their AI systems. Um, it's a, a very good espionage technique for getting leverage on, on Indians. Um, it gives advantages in um, commercial transactions because you can find out what the Indians are bidding when they're competing against uh, Chinese companies in Africa, for example, if you can have access to the phones and the communication system. Uh, there are a whole range of, of uh, malign activity that was being accomplished by getting those Chinese apps on the Indian phones. No other country has managed to do that yet. And after that, there was a, a reassessment of Chinese investment in, FD, in foreign direct investment. China keep, kept hitting India. They didn't do it kinetically like in Galwan, but they went after the iPhone parts manufacturing plant. They hit the Mumbai electrical grid. The Maoists killed about 20 people. Um, there was a whole range of threats to uh, uh, India. Um, India hit back in a range of ways. It talked about what happened with the Mumbai electrical grid. It talked about what happened with the iPhone parts manufacturing plant. Um, when there were odd people who were, you know, the backing parts of the um, uh, protests, farmers' protests, there was discussions about where was that money coming from, where were the where was the backing coming from. Um, so this comprehensive defense that was put in place by India to deal with the Chinese comprehensive national power push against India was something that. Uh, I've learned, I've personally learned a lot from.